the United States has quietly approved and delivered more than 100 separate foreign military sales to Israel since October 7th. That includes thousands of munitions, small diameter bombs, buster bunkers, small arms, and other types of lethal aid. A key way that the sales avoided public scrutiny is because each individual sale of the 100 fall below a monetary threshold that would require the executive branch to submit the notification to Congress. U.S. arms sales to Israel have come under the microscope because the war in Gaza has created such an enormous civilian death toll. There's a lack of food, water, and medicine. The vast majority of Israel's arsenal uh, is from the United States. The Biden administration has been under pressure to use U.S. military assistance as a leverage to get some of the things that it wants out of the Israelis, whether that is more aid going into Gaza or to lower the tempo of their military campaign. What our reporting shows is that there has been actually a steady influx of military assistance, even while at the same time, the United States has publicly expressed strong reservations about the way that Israel is conducting the war.